Hey, what's up, guys? So, um, I have here my Crossman M4 and my uh, Crossman DPMS, and I have this uh, extra V Life uh, sight. Um, so, what I wanted to do was take the bipod off of the M4 and put it on the DPMS. Um, so, I figured I'd just film the process. Um, I'm just sitting at home. It's about 11 o'clock at night. I'm kind of tired. Um, I don't have any CO2 right now. I'm waiting for it uh, to come on Amazon. It should be here tomorrow, hopefully, so I could get into some more reviews. But um, anyways, um, I figured I'd film the process. So I'm going to take the bipod off of the M4 and put it on the DPMS. I'm going to leave the uh, handguard or the foregrip there and put the bipod right on front. And then I'll put the sight on top. Uh, eventually, I'll get a much better sight. I have a flashlight laser sight uh, combo coming, so uh, eventually I'll put it on that. So I'm going to take uh, the bipod off here of the M4. So let me just find the correct, I think this is the correct Allen key here. Yeah, so it's pretty simple. You just uh, put it in, um, unscrew it. You don't even have to take this thing all the way out. It just usually comes off like that um let me just put the allen key down put the gun down um i just wanted to put the bipod on the dpms because um having it on the front of the m4 since this is pneumatic every time i go to pump it i have to pull on the bipod so i don't want to bend it in any way so i figured it'd be better on here um, so what I'm going to do now is just take the M4, I mean the DPMS, wow this is much heavier, and uh, I'm going to uh, put it right on the front here. I want to have it flush sort of with the, uh, the muzzle, I don't want it to go too much past the muzzle, so I'm going to attempt to do that. Uh, let me just try to get this on without... Uh, having to take that whole screw off uh, let me just get that LD. but yeah guys I can't wait to get CO2 uh, I just ordered the BB tac 2 so I'll do a review on that soon um, but uh, I think I got this good here I'm gonna put this on right there uh, it's pretty simple it goes on oh wow I'm not even tightening it on Alright, hold on one sec, guys. So you gotta make sure it's actually on the other side. I'm gonna have to unscrew it a little bit more. There we go. There, now it's on. Um, now I could tighten it up. There we go. Now I can feel it going on. Alright, so now that's the DPMS with the uh, bipod on it. Put that down so you can see. This bipod is cool. Put a link in the description for it. It's kind of cheap. Um, But you just pull down the legs like this. And then each leg has its own little button you push. And it just pops out. And then uh, you just sit it up like that. It's really cool um and then to put the legs away you have to actually push down the button again right here and then push in and it just locks in um but yeah i like these bipods a lot um i think they're all also made by v life i really like this company uh cv life rather i always call it v life um the site is also made by cv life uh, they're just a really good company. I really like their products. So I have the rear sight and the foresight already Obviously on the DPMS, but I figured a sight would look much better on here This is too small of a sight For something like this, but uh, I'm gonna get a much better sight eventually in the future So I'm just gonna put this on for now uh, Just so I don't have it laying around that way it's actually attached to something. Um, I have another one attached to my HK MP5, so I'm gonna put this on here. Um, let me just get it, uh, the Allen key ready here. 
Uh, I just have to unscrew it. Let me just find the right size. I believe that is the right size. Yes, it is. I gotta unscrew these just slightly. There we go. Now it's on. Sorry, guys. I don't mean to keep going off camera. But, yeah, there we go. I don't know if that's too far back, but I'm pretty sure that's okay. Um, this goes back. So it shouldn't be too much of a big deal. And uh, yeah, that's it. Now it's on. Nice and firmly. Not too tight. Not too loose. Um, you put that down. And then now you have this. You have uh, the sight with the bipod. Um, again, I'm going to switch for the scope with the flashlight. Um, I'm going to put the laser and the flashlight attachment on here. I'm going to hook this thing up, uh, but I love this DPMS, this thing is awesome, uh, as soon as I get some CO2, I'll do a review on this, so, um, until then, I can't really do anything, uh, I can't show you how to put CO2 in it, and I can't show you how to shoot anything, um, so yeah, guys, so, that's all I wanted to do for now, uh, so I figured I'd film it, like I said, but, uh, anyways, guys, until the next review, uh, I hope you have a great night, and, uh, I'm gonna go put these guys away now, and, uh, I'll see you later. Peace. Here I am.